Rosa, the last one is for you. And here it is. Give mm. the tickets. You will lose them. I will put them in my pocket. What do you think the answer is, Rosa? You made the tickets. Can you finish the rest? Yeah. You will lose them. I'll put them in my pocket. Very good job. Give me the tickets. You will lose them. I will put them in my pocket. Good job, everybody. And now it's time to listen and write. Listen and write. Now listen and write these sentences. Number one. The singer played a tambourine. Number two. The guitarist was drinking a coffee. Number three. The bass player was wearing black faded jeans. Number four, the beautiful vocalist threw the pink roses into the happy audience. Number five, the organist played his solo slowly. Number six, Robert always buys his concert tickets at the door. Number seven, I want to meet the bass player and my brother wants to meet the drummer. Number eight, we were waiting outside for an autograph, but Rod Stewart had already left. Number nine, you can go to the concert by yourselves. And number ten, that guitar pick is mine. Now, check your work. Number one, the singer played a tambourine. Number two, the guitarist was drinking a coffee. Number three, the bass player was wearing black faded jeans. Number four, the beautiful vocalist threw the pink roses into the happy audience. Number five, the organist played his solo slowly. Number six, Robert always buys his concert tickets at the door. Number seven, I want to meet the I want to meet the bass player, and my brother wants to meet the drummer. Number eight, we were waiting outside for an autograph, but Rod Stewart had already left. Number nine, you can go to the concert by yourselves. And finally, number 10, that guitar pick is mine. Now read the story and answer the questions. Read and answer. <laughs> Callie is a groupie. This means that she loves to go to exciting rock concerts and meet the musicians in the band. When the show is finished, she always tries to go backstage by herself. Sometimes she is lucky. 
Sometimes a big, angry security guard escorts her outside quickly. Fortunately, one of the security guards is her boyfriend. He sometimes helps her go backstage and meet the stars. Sometimes he can't help her because his boss is working. Kelly has met many famous stars. She met Bruce Springsteen in March. She thought he was friendly. He was busy, but he still found a minute to meet her. She met Avril Lavigne last summer. Avril was very shy and quiet. It was her first tour. Kelly wants to meet Bono. She wants him to give her an autograph. Unfortunately, U2 is not on tour this summer. Kelly is Irish, so of course she loves U2. Now listen and answer these questions. Number one. What is a groupie? Number two. What does Kelly always try to do when the show is finished? Number three. What is her boyfriend's job? Number four. Why can't he help her sometimes? Number five. Who did Kelly meet in March? Number six. What did she think about Bruce Springsteen? Number seven. When did she meet Avril Lavigne? Number eight. Why was Avril shy? Number nine. Who is Bono? Number ten. What is Kelly's nationality? <coughs> now check your work. Number one. What is a groupie? A groupie is a person who likes to meet rock stars. Number two. What does Kelly always try to do when the show is finished? She always tries to go backstage by herself. Number three, what is her boyfriend's job? He is a security guard. Number four, why can't he help her sometimes? He can't help her sometimes because his boss is there. Number six, who did Kelly meet in March? She met Bruce Springsteen in March. Number six, what did she think about Bruce Springsteen? She thought he was friendly. Seven, when did she meet Avril Lavigne? She met Avril last summer. Why was Avril shy? It was her first tour. Number nine, who is Bono? He is in the group U2. Number ten, what is Kelly's nationality? She is Irish. See you next time. Goodbye. Practicing English. I was talking with my students in class today about music. It was amazing to learn what kind of music they like to listen to. All kinds of things.、Um, arabesque, pop music, classical music, and even opera. I was really surprised by the variety of musical tastes. Yeah, they like a lot of different things. Recently in my class, they asked what kind of music I listened to when I was in college. Can I take your order? What do you have to drink? We have coffee, cappuccino, and tea. I'll have a tea. I'll have、okay. a cappuccino. 
I'll have an okay. orange juice. Tea, please. Okay. So I'm curious too, Monica. What did you tell them? Well, I have three older brothers in my family who love classic rock. You know, the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, Aerosmith, Led Zeppelin. I think I've heard Stairway to Heaven 10,000 times. Tarek, what about you? Well, I prefer modern music like hip-hop and dance. That's what I grew up with. Hmm. Have you guys noted that popular music today is different from 15 years ago? What do you mean, Carrie? Well, it seems that songs here come and go so quickly. A group puts out an album or a song. It's around for a year. Then it's gone and no one remembers. I think that's right. When my class was talking today, they named some musicians and groups they listen to and follow. And to be honest, I, I had never heard of most of them. That's because you're getting old, Dave. Very funny, Monica. Okay, time for a favorite musician survey. Okay, go. What questions do you want to ask? Hmm, let's start with Monica. Okay, I'm ready. Go ahead and ask. Okay, first question. Who was the first album, CD or cassette that you bought for yourself? Hmm, that's easy. It was a Duran Duran tape. I bought it when Big Hair and Spandex were really popular. <laughs> Okay, second question. Who's the best rock singer? Hmm, that's more difficult. But I think that Robert Plant from Led Zeppelin was really great. I loved him. Dave, here's a different question. Who is the best rock guitar player? That's easy. The Rolling Stones are my all-time favorite band. So I would have to say Keith Richards is the best guitar player. And Mick Jagger is the best singer ever for a rock band. Hmm, really? I'm not sure I totally agree with you. Oh, really? Well, let's ask you the same question. Who's your favorite rock guitar player? Well, I'm more of an Aerosmith fan. Joe Perry on guitar and Steve T Tyler as they really works for me. Yeah, I like them too. In high school, my friends and I thought they were incredible. Ah, uh, Tarek, we didn't ask you what your musical favorites are. How about you share your ideas? Well, believe it or not, I'm here with the students at the school. I don't... I hardly know who you guys are talking about. Mick Jagger, Steve Tyler... Who are those guys? They're all old grandpas. Isn't Mick Jagger 60 years old? Yeah, these guys have been around for ages. But we like them for their music, not their age. Well, I'm not really into the classic rock that you guys are talking about. What kind of music do you like, Tarek? Well, I like to go to raves. You know, those all-night dance parties where people dance until dawn. We don't really have a band. There's a DJ who keeps the music going for hours. People dance and dance all night. Wow, I didn't know you liked going to raves. My sister just went to one of those back home, and she had a great time. Well, next time I go, I'll let you know. If you want to come, it could be a lot of fun. In fact, you could all come if you want to. That'd be cool. Shall we go? Sure. Hmm. Mm -hmm.